Hi friends, my name is Raj and you are watching TechBite. So in this video, I will show you how to upgrade your Windows 10 32-bit operating system to 64-bit without losing any data. So first I will show you my system properties. And you can see I am using Windows 10 Pro Edition and my system type is 32-bit operating system and you can see the option x64 base processor that means my processor is compatible for 64 bit operating system so i can easily upgrade to 64 bit so i have two partition and i have some data in my partition d i will show you these are the files and folder and i have some files on my desktop as well so your data will remain safe there will be no data loss but your softwares the installed software will be removed after upgrading to 64 bit so let's start first you have to download media creation tool from internet it will help you to uh, download the windows 10 iso image open your browser and type media creation tool and you can see the first url use this url to download media creation tool scroll down and you can see the option download tool now use this option and the tool has been started to download now open the download folder cut this software from download folder and paste it on the desktop it will easier to understand now run this software media creation tool run this tool and with the help of this tool we can easily download 64 bit windows 10 operating system iso image i will fast forward this video now you can see you have two option upgrade this pc now and the other option is create installation media so choose the second option then click on next now untick this option and you can see you choose your language now select the 64 bit option then click on next to download the file size will be between 4 GB to 4.5 GB maximum. So now you have two options. Create a USB flash drive or you can download the ISO file. So I will choose the second option. ISO file. I will create a bootable media manually. After downloading the Windows 10 ISO image. Click on next to download. Now select the location. Click on save. Download process has been started. I will fast forward this video. Now you can see file has been downloaded and the size is around 4.03 GB. So now you can easily create a bootable media by the help of Rufos. You can use Rufos to create a bootable USB pen drive. I will show you how to download the Rufos software. Open your browser and type Rufos. It's a very easy and simple software to create your pen drive bootable. Now you can see the download has been done now. And you can use Rufos to create your bootable pen drive of windows 10 64 bit operating system now run this software and insert your pen drive i already have a bootable pen drive of windows 10 so i will show you the interface of rufos now you can see insert your pen drive and it's very easy to create a bootable pen drive with Rufos. So uh, after 
creating your bootable pen drive restart your laptop or system then boot from your pen drive now boot from the pen drive I will fast forward this video now click on next click on install now now choose your edition I will choose pro and you can see it's 64 bit click on next I accept the license terms click on next now click on custom option the second option now you have to choose the same partition which contains the windows 32 bit operating system then click on next now you can see your file and folder will remain safe and will be moved to another folder name windows dot old folder so there will be no data loss your file and folder will be moved to another folder click on ok and the process has been started and it will take around uh, 15 to 20 minutes to complete I will fast forward this video so one important thing you have to choose the same partition which contains your 32 bit operating system now it's almost done now configure as per your requirement now you can see it's almost done my profile is creating now you can see it's done and first I will show you my properties and you can see windows 10 pro and system type 64 bit operating system system bit has been upgraded to 64 bit from 32 bit and then i will show you the data and you can see the my other partition d drive and all the file and folder are remain safe there will be no data loss and my desktop data i will show you it will be moved to another folder open your C drive then open windows dot old folder then click on users open it then click on the login name of your system and open desktop folder and you can see these are the files and folder and all files and folder are remain safe there will be no data loss you can see so this is how you can upgrade your 32 bit operating system to 64 bit without losing any data but your softwares the installed software will remove I will show you You can see all the software are removed because they are installed as per 32 bit so this is how you can upgrade windows 10 32 bit to 64 bit without losing any data
थैंक यू